What's up everybody? Russell Nook here and I hope you're all doing well. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Mattel WWE Edge Ultimate Edition action figure. So here's the product box itself. There's the big window display showing you everything that is offered inside this package. You've got the figure on the left. You've got an alternate head sculpt right there in the center. You've got alternate sets of arms and hands as well and an overcoat on the far right. So this is from his return, which is why I got it. Had it not been for his return, I don't know if I would have picked this up. I used to think Finn Balor's Demon Ultimate figure was the most lacking in that entire line. But now that I have this Edge figure in hand, I gotta say, it's this figure. Don't get me wrong, the deco is fantastic. This is honest to what he came back in. This is his return. This is huge. But at the end of the day, it's just an alternate set of arms and an overcoat. I mean, it would have been nice to have a chair or maybe even the rated R title. Even though that's not this era, it would have been nice to have something a little extra. But anyway, I'm getting ahead of myself. Here's the product. Big window display, you can see the name here at the top, Edge. You got Ultimate Edition down there at the bottom, and of course that window display showing you everything inside. You've also got this side right here, showing Edge grinning. You've also got the back of the box. Facts from the box. also got the name right here and here's the top and there's the bottom so let's go ahead and get this open shall we and there he is out of that product box but before we get rid of that product box let's take a look and see what it has to say this go around mm-hmm 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 The ultimate opportunist. And you think you know me. Classic. Classic. All right, now let's give this a once over and make sure that we don't have any tags or anything like that on this figure. It looks like we do. There for the arms. All right, and another snap. All right, and there's the figure. Now, before we take a closer look, let's go over the accessories that he came with. So, here's that alternate head sculpt. Now, that is intense. Don't get me wrong, this looks intimidating for sure. I mean, that is a sight to behold, but having the hair pose like this whoo, really limits your options here. So we'll see how this comes into play later. You've also got his entrance coat. Great detail work. Look at that. The silver is where the silver needs to be. It doesn't all look the same. There seems to be texture work. Fantastic. Fantastic. And of course, the alternate arms and hands. Pinless elbows, too. That's nice. All right, now let's take a look at this figure. So here's the rated R superstar himself. From his return back to the WWE Universe. 
amazing. Let's see. Uh, ball and socket here at the head. Nothing too crazy. It goes back that much. Goes forward that much. Side to side. Just like that. Let's see how easy it pops off. Because it is an ultimate. No problem taking that head off. No problem at all. All right. Now the shoulders go all the way around. And they do go out. You also have... Ooh, that's right. They pop out because it's the swappable shoulders. So no butterflies. No butterflies here. But... You can swap the arms out. Uh, that's how you simulate the entrance coat. You've also got bicep swivel, and you should have double hinged elbows. Yep, because it's an elite figure. Look at that tattoo work. Oh, and the elbow pads are detailed. Well, in that they're painted. Nice. Oh, yeah, more tattoo work. Look at that. You got wrist swivel here at the uh, hinge wrist swivel, hinge swivel at the wrist. And of course these do pop out. You got this mid torso rocker, waist swivel, hips uh, goes up that much, goes down, goes out that much. You got thigh swivel, double jointed knees. You've got calf swivel oh those tough rockers and of course toe joints because it's an ultimate figure look at this deco that's impressive wow we wow we i mean so i guess you know the trade-off is always more accessories or less detail and here we got more detail and rightfully so i mean this is an ultimate figure commemorating edges commemorating edges return to the wwe universe that's huge that's huge from a career threatening injury that forced him into retirement he came back and it's still going strong wild So even when you have this head on there, like you can't really go that far back. You know, this is, this pretty much limits you for what you can do. I mean, I guess that's a pretty intimidating action pose. I'm going to make this work. I'm going to make this work. That's pretty good. I'm not going to lie. That's pretty good. Sweet. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. If you enjoyed what you saw, then please like, comment, share, subscribe, and be sure to hit that bell notification so you'll be informed as to my next video upload. If anything else, I'll see you next time, and have a good one. You gotta be kidding me. The rated R Superstar! Edge is here!